So today, I would like to be talking about money in the United States. So United States is um, considered, at least in the United States, to be the most free country in the world. On some levels, I do agree with that. I do. We have a lot of freedoms, like we won't get our heads cut off if we say how we're feeling. Things of that nature. We're free to make um, our own careers. If we want to, we can start a business, things like that. There are not too many restrictions or whatever, but, um, you know... There are a couple things I have a problem with involving money. Okay, for example, when the United States gives money to other countries, and I'm not talking about like a couple dollars, I'm talking about billions of dollars, trillions of dollars being spent where is that money coming from? I think people have the illusion in their head that this money is coming from taxpayer dollars. Okay, it isn't. They are printing out paper in the treasury and handing that money over to other countries, and all of a sudden we're in debt. Is this, is this paper money based on gold? No, it isn't. We don't have enough gold to back all the money that we're sending out. What we do have is a bunch of guns, ammunition, supplies for war, and food and supplies to be traded to other countries, resources. The paper money is not based on anything anymore. It's not based on anything. Whenever they need money, they just print money out, give it away, and all of a sudden we're in debt. The gold standard does not mean anything. Money is fake. It does not mean anything when it's being traded country to country. It is used to control people. Everybody's time is worth the same amount of money. A minimum wage worker and a boss. Whatever time they work, their time is equal. I don't care what you say. Without a, without a minimum wage, without a minimum wage worker, there will be no boss. What's a boss gonna do if he doesn't have any minimum wage workers? Who's he gonna be boss of? We're all equal.